Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Alpana Screen Brothers. I am Alpana here and uh, today I am going to show you one of my uh, small tray garden. So friends, I am very much interested in uh, making this tray gardens because I can play with my succulents and beautiful small small cute toys uh, that is why it's a kind of uh, game for me so friends this is a small uh, pot light green in color and uh, this pot I has I had made last year with uh, mix and match of cuttings of different uh, succulents and over the year this succulents have grown quite big and uh, they have filled up my small pot and uh, in the center there is a cute owl and uh, yes what I have used here I have used in the behind those are campfires I like campfires they are very easy to grow and uh, uh, and uh, in my tropical place in tropical place uh, like uh, my place uh, where it is very difficult to grow succulents in uh, summer and uh, rainy season they can be uh, kept for the year and can be regrown so that is why I like them very much so in shade they usually they remain green but when you expose them to sunlight they become red in color and uh, they give you very vibrant red in colors so I like them very much so they are known as campfires these are my campfires so they are uh, if they they are suitable to your place then they are not fussy at all and they can you can uh, grow them very easily and these are graptopetalum uh, I think they are also known as host plant if I am not wrong then I have Echeveria then uh, these are also Graptovaria and this is the same variety two two cuttings are there and uh, I forgot the name of this Echeveria this is Echeveria only but I, I don't know I forgot the name and this was a very small cutting uh, actually I have propagated it from a leaf uh, and over the year it has grown this big and as it was uh, uh, lack of light uh, at this side so it, it has become leggy but still it is looking beautiful isn't it it is looking beautiful so this is how it looks my tray garden so you have to be patient with succulents because they are slow growing and uh, you never know uh, you might while growing them you might lose them because of the rain and the hot temperature and uh, but as soon as the temperature um, comes down they start reviving again so that's a plus point but you have to careful while growing them in uh, well, this hot climates so I usually keep them under shade but in airy area so that they do not uh, they do not die because of moisture and humidity but still I almost lose lose them half half of them I lose but still I never give up on succulents because I love them very much uh, and uh, that's it that's how my succulents become so it is always preferable if you go the hardies hardy varieties so that you are not demoralized later on so this is my cute succulent tray, tray with mixing of lots of cuttings and leaf propagation of succulents so friends i hope you like my channel and my videos if you do so so please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and press the like and bell icon so that you can get immediate notification as soon as i upload a new video
and friends please do comment in the comment section i'd be i'll feel very glad to answer them all thank you friends until next time take care happy gardening